this video, we're going to go over a combination movement of a bird dog with a row variation. So working on core stability or your core's ability to resist rotational movements of the spine while you're moving your arms and your legs. So this is your powerhouse, this is your foundation. We want to work on strengthening that. And then again, we're going to combine it with a row variation with weight. So since the bird dog is in the unstable position, because you'll just be on one arm and one leg instead of two arms and two legs, choose a lighter weight to begin with. Make sure your form is on point um, and then progress over time to make it more challenging. Again, form is always the most important. If you feel anything in the lower back, back down a little bit in the weight. If you still feel pain in the back without weight and just the weight of your arms still painful, just focus on kicking the leg back and keeping both arms on the ground while you're doing so. So as far as setup itself, I have a dumbbell here. So whatever side you're gonna have the weight in, you're gonna be straightening out the opposite leg. So if it's under my left hand, my right leg is kicking back. So you want your wrists to be stacked under your shoulders, your knees stacked under your hips, find pelvic neutral so you don't wanna be overly extended and arched like this. You don't want to be overly rounded and tucked like this. I'm going to find the middle of the road, lock it in, core is tight. Again, you want this to be your firm foundation. Only thing that's moving is your arm and your leg. So once you're here, I want you to focus on breathing. So you're going to breathe breathing out as you lift. Breathing in as you come back to start position. So what you want to resist when you're in this position is any type of rotation in the spine. Again, you just want to be locked in place. You're very steady. If I were to come push you, you should not move. Also, another good cue is with the back leg to picture pushing back into a wall instead of picking your leg up. You can see the difference. And if you look at this part of myself here and here, I can keep this flat if I focus on the cue of kicking my heel back into a wall versus kicking up my leg. You can see how my hips kind of rotate open and I kind of rotate from the lower back. We want to keep, again, everything nice and in line. So focus on that cue of just kicking back. So that's the bird dog with a row variation.